Amen. It's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest on 2K in existence. And listen up, I'm gonna be giving y'all the best jump shots for every height, every archetype, every play style in the game. Okay, 5'7 through the 6'4, the 6'5 through the 6'9, the 6'10 plus. All the best jump shots, a good variety. This video is very, this is the most important video. You can literally be better than 80% of the community if you learn to shoot. Okay, last year I shot 75 plus from three. Okay, playing with randoms. This year I'm on 85 right now, only played a little bit. And I have a 95 win percent every year and beat the greatest to ever touch 2K in several 2Ks. Okay, you can listen to this. Spread this video to help people learn to shoot so people aren't so horrible in these in this damn random wreck etc man and i'm gonna be giving y'all a bunch of tips after all the jump shots before we get to all that y'all make sure y'all subscribe if y'all are new we'll be keeping you up to date with all the best jumpers best dribble moves best builds and hilarious games get this video to a thousand likes man i'm helping y'all out now firstly right here man okay got chris bosh i didn't really like chris bosh last year right but this year it seemed pretty decent it seemed pretty decent i shot with it a little Bit. it's a lower requirement and these are the releases i got okay you see you, you got the a plus the a plus height is for the 610 plus okay. i don't know if this is gate kept i think you can get this off rip you know try this out all you need is an 81 height is what y'all want in your jump shots okay and you want to look at the animations to make sure you're not going forward if y'all you know y'all want the sauce to how to make it yourself here goes another one okay another 610 plus you see you see this look at this right to the head nice kind of easy you know and he not too much going forward he got good release height your release speed pretty decent now look this is a op jump shot for little guards okay i'm shooting 85 percent with this and Kyrie right now on my little guard my little 63 and um this is like the meta that everyone's trying okay so i mean y'all could try this out y'all little guards y'all let me know and also put your favorite jump shot down below let me know y'all's favorite Favorite so far we got this aj okay look this is for a lower rate in 78 okay you even if you have a lower rating you can mess with this look a plus release okay now look i'm gonna show you all my favorite jump shot soon because they ain't got the t mac yet right it's that culver i'm gonna show you my versions i've been telling y'all since last year that goddamn culver is the truth okay it's the baby t mac Okay. Now look, this is for lower ratings again. You don't get too much high, so you might be contested, but this is good for, you know, it easy to time. I tested this whole out. And look, you even get this on lower ratings, but you know, I got the Oscar and the Corver to it. You can make it even lower, okay? Look, Kobe Bryant, is it's, it's, it's a good shot, okay? Y'all know they always nerf the OP things in the next year, so maybe Kobe can really be that one. Kobe's looking like one of them one, okay? Nice, easy to time. Here goes another one low rating okay you can even get it lower if you switch the releases okay look you, you kind of go backwards you feel me ray allen ray allen's always good every year it's looking like it's making a more return with some nerf bases this is nice easy smooth butter you know nice beautiful you know mm, check it out man let me know kyle corver it's amazing jump shot very very fast look i even ticked the speed down you can have it faster if you want but it's a very fast jump shot it's pretty good man test it out let me see if you like it this year this could be one of the ones since bases are nerfed now the scotty pippen probably the truth okay it might be the truth you know you see i slowed it down right you can you know but it might be the truth you know since you know they like to scotty pippen could be the one okay we're gonna find out later on now look, here goes the beautiful cold baby T-Mac. T-Mac is locked behind the um rep, I'm pretty sure. This is the shot, okay? For all the poppers, big ISO guard builds, this is the shot. You want the Culver, okay? The Culver, look, all the way to 610. Every build, this is the one. If you're struggling, put the Culver on, test it out. Then you can experiment more with different ones, but this is the one. That is going to help you be more consistent. Tell your friends so you can have a more enjoyable experience. A lot of people hate people that help people enjoy their ga their gaming experience on a game that costs hundreds and thousands of dollars. I don't know, bro. You just want to hit the ball, hit sh hit the shot wide open. And, you know, let's try to help y'all out, bro. Here's another one for, you know, little builds. It's a nice, nice motion, nice release. You can really see the, can see the angles, all that. See, I ticked it down. Allen Iverson, this is the baby T-Mac. This could be one of them ones, okay? Since jump shots is nerfed, this, this is the baby T-Mac for little guys. It's good. I tested it out. It's smooth. Rock with it, man. Now, this look a little glitchy. I hate when it does that. I wish they would fix the uh, Robertson release. But here's another good one, man. You can really see your hands real, real good. Look, this is for lower rating, okay? 
you get these grades. Another version of the Allen Ivers. Look, lower grades are uh, lower ratings also. Okay? Look, you don't get up too much, but look, lower grades. If you use different releases, you could have it even lower. For some reason, you made a little guard build that <laughs> has a low midi and three point. You can rock with this. Look, Isaiah Thomas this is another good one. Okay, check it. Look, all the round, all the A's. Feel me? Test it out. Feet come together, kind of go forward a little bit, but it looked good. Now look, this one, lower rating, okay? Lower rating, 75. You can even make it lower. You know, you can switch it up. Hey, looking like a good shot, man. But trigger effect, this is very important. Please, guys, please send this video to your friends. When I play with randoms, especially the old heads, dog, that you hear it, you hear it, bro. <laughs> That's all you hear in their controller. <laughs> Bro, you can't play like that. It's disrupting you, okay? This is okay, but the trigger effect is in. <laughs> Bro, you gotta, you know, you got something tripping in your hand bro how can you play you know just when dribble it's gonna it's gonna intimidate you you're gonna mess up your shots it's turn it off guys okay now look your shot timing profile put it here okay either here or here you can start off here this description it says similar to previous 2ks but according to 2k uh 2k lab chart that's not true because that doesn't represent those 2ks or i don't i don't know what's going on now look this is according to nba 2k okay this is the low risk right you don't want this guys maybe if you lag or you're from some other area where you don't play on good servers and you're trying to play with other people maybe do something like this but and then they say, this is medium, and this is how the other 2Ks was, bro. <laughs> it would it, it would be more around like these areas and stuff. So, I mean, the description is wrong when you read it. All, all they did with these newer 2Ks, guys, is they just made all the whites you would make back then, they just made them green. They just opened up the green window. That's all they did, bro. And 2K Lab confirmed that. You know, when I was telling people that when they first introduced Green or Mist. So, I mean, maybe y'all can start on this if you want, but when you see high risk, you're going to want to do high risk. You see, like you have a way higher make percent. This is according to 2K Lab. And uh, yeah, and th all this is not counting all your badges, your jump shot meter off. I'm pretty sure your momentum, you, you building up your takeover. So it's going to be like green even more, you know? So yeah, okay, now look, bro. 2K makes it to where you have to have shooting boost to be able to shoot consistent. I know it costs VC, but if you wanna shoot as good as you can, you gotta buy the uh, the shooting boost, bro. That That's just how it is. And it gotta do with your Gatorade, so make sure you're doing your Gatorade drills and all that, man. And I think you even get a discount unless they took it out this year, but you gotta have jump shot boost and some form of Gatorade so you know you have a bigger stamina meter and all this and that while you're moving around, you shoot the ball. Hey. You don't need all of them, but you need some of them, especially if you're a guard. They make you pay to play to uh, be consistent in the game. If you can manage without it, rock with it, but that's just how it be. Now, secondly, before you play online, okay, this is very important. You want to get your hot spots. I'm pretty sure before you even go get your lethal zones, I'm going to show y'all where that is and everything. Get your hot spots first. Someone clarify down below, but get your red spots first and then go do your lethals. Because last year they had it to where, say you went in there and you didn't even have a hot spot and you did your lethals, it wouldn't go to purple. So, and you get to get three purples for three weeks, I believe. So, unless someone says something down below, make sure you get your hot spots red before you go get your lethals don't play online unless you get your hot zones guys listen don't play online unless you get your hot zones you will miss it it don't even matter if you have your bad you need your hot zones okay every 2k it's so important tell your friends people don't know this on all your builds you need your hot zones okay you need your hot zone now it could you could get them through the my career 12 minutes lowest difficult right or i'm gonna show you all these courts now look to get your hot zones pretty easy you're gonna want to go to the temple or the dooms okay look let me show you wait hold on where where that where that the dooms okay dooms or the temple. it's right here okay or you could do the my career lowest difficulty y'all let me know which is easiest so far look right here you got the board these people this is where you're going to do it at, man. Definitely need to get this badge max to be able to shoot consistently online, man. A lot of your shots are going to be with this badge. And a lot of your shots are going to be with this badge, too. You need to get this up. Art of Shooting Gym. This is where you're going to want to go to get your purples. Get your reds first. Get your red hot zones first. You're going to go in here. It looked clean. It looked clean. I don't know if it's just because it's new or what. It looked clean to me. Feel me? You know, you know what? We don't. We don't look kind of clean. You feel me? It looked clean. 
but make sure you learn your shot before you actually attempt this. I hear the Gatorade drills closing app is patched. Someone let me know down below. I don't know. Cause y'all know if you mess up, you could close app. I don't know if you could close app on this. Like if you, you're starting to mess up. So, you know, figure that out. Let, let, let me know so I can let everybody else know. So, you know, we can have more fun on the game. Now, of course, you want to have no shot meter. You get a 20% boost to your green window. That's what they say. It's way easier to shoot without it. Just do it. I don't care. It don't help you guys. Just do it, bro. Trust me. Now, look some people in previous 2ks you know y'all know having all this stuff on and off look you could take off a lot of stuff the green release animations you could take it all off if you know some people believe that adds latency and lag to your player you know so you could take off a lot of these things no ball trail a lot of people shoot way better without the ball trail so you know you can have this type of stuff off even when it comes to the feedback some people have it off i always keep it on but some people turn this off and they say they shoot better so if you're really struggling or you're really delayed or laggy and you know you, i mean you could test this out see if it helped but you know that's just a method anywho click the video on the screen if you want the best settings in nba 2k25 to be a uh a dribble hot but hey hey here we go again yeah. here we go again people talking this but when this hit the fan everything i'm that made me now break it down yo off the top of the dome, dome.